Hi, I'm Carrie, and you're watching Wandering Roots. Today, we're going to be giving you a tour of Heritage Motor Coach Resort in Orange Beach, Alabama. As I said, we're here at Heritage Motor Coach Resort and Marina in Orange Beach, Alabama. This resort is absolutely beautiful. It's stunning. It's it, quiet, very quiet. Mm -hmm. Very quiet. These are all owned units and we're just renting a unit for, we stayed here four nights, three nights so far, tonight's our fourth night. So they all have a little house on them, like a little cottage, I would say. And inside the cottage, I can see in the windows, when you rent, the cottage is locked, so you can't go inside. It's the owners only. But you can peek Only inside. for the owner. <laughs> yeah, but you can peek, because mm -hmm. they left the blinds open. So inside the cottage, there's a little kitchen area, um, a living room that has a couch, which I'm assuming makes out into a bed so someone can sleep in there, and then there's a restroom in this one. I think they're all different. I think some of them have just a bedroom, and they're all the same size, but a different layout, I just think. A different floor plan for each? Yes. Each unit. So this place is a luxury motor coach resort, so you have to be in a class A motor home that's at least 34 feet. 34 feet, and it can't be more than 10 years old. Yes, and there is, there's, everyone in here has a beautiful motor home. It's just yeah, super. Yeah, everything in here is pretty much brand new, super big, nice. nice motor homes. So this place is beautifully landscaped. Everything is pristine, very well taken care of, manicured. And this is the only luxury motor coach resort that has its own personal beach and the, the beach is so beautiful it's white sands um it also has a marina for the owners that can store their boats there i think you can buy a boat slip um with your when you buy your lot certain lots that are for sale in here have a boat slip that comes with it mm -hmm. so yeah, and there is, there's like six or seven that are for sale right now. They're around 300,000, I think most of them They were like 250 to 350, somewhere in, mm -hmm. To buy and have your own, and then I think you can rent them out, and you probably get some of the income from yeah. renting them out as well. You do own one and you rent it, they do not use your cottage. Mm -hmm. That It's strictly, they use the motor, they can, they can park the motor coach there. Anything you do not want people using, you cover it up. They have custom covers and everything. So if it's covered, you do not use it. Even if it's out, it's available for you to use as a renter. Yes, all the owners here that we've met have seemed super nice. Especially one that lives right over here. She's a <laughs> the party mayor. Of yeah, we love the mayor. mayor. Self appointed mayor. She was super nice. A who. Um, Hurricane Sally did hit here a couple months ago and so the beach is currently closed and the marina is pretty wiped out. Pretty but destroyed. We talked to one gentleman who lives here and he said that he thinks by March, April that it'll be about back to normal. Um, it has a beautiful pool. It has an infinity pool. It's an infinity pool that oh, yeah. looks. Oh, the, the view from here is gorgeous. If you walk down to like where their office buildings are and their pool, the view is gorgeous. It's in a bay, so right across the way is... Gulf of Mexico Ocean. Yes. It goes where we're at, then there's a little bay, you can see a strip of land, mm -hmm. and then right on the other side of that strip is the uh, Gulf. Yes, the Gulf ocean. of Mexico. The ocean. the ocean. A beautiful beach as well over there, especially... Um, we spent some time in Gulf Shores, and that was a beautiful beach. We haven't been over to the beach because, as you can see, it's a little chilly right now. Mm -hmm. It's it's November 30th, and they've had some storms come in, and it's pretty chilly here. And they actually issued a freeze warning 
for yeah. tonight. So for tonight, so we've been be bundled cooler. up. Us from Utah are freezing, <laughs> but it was beautiful when we first got here. It was super warm, and the weather was beautiful. And the weather's beautiful right now. It's just cold. So we definitely recommend the Heritage Motor Coach Resort and Marina. This place is luxury motor coach resort at its finest. So if you're in southern Alabama in the Orange Beach area, I would highly recommend coming here. It's close to a Walmart for groceries. There's gas stations close by, McDonald's. The beach is a 10 minute drive. Gulf Shore State Park is a 15 minute drive. There are bike trails. There's private cabins. There's actually a campground there, but you don't want to stay there. You want to stay here. Mm -hmm. At Gulf Shores, there are bike trails there you can ride. You can see alligators, birds, snakes, turtles, everything. There's also a bike trail right across the street from here, and so you could hop on your bike or golf cart and ride that all the way into town. So definitely, if you are anywhere in Alabama, if this is on your road trip plans, stop here. You won't be disappointed. Highly recommended. Do it, do it, do it. Do it. Do it. Like she said, do it. <laughs> yeah, for sure. So if you enjoyed this video today, please subscribe to our channel and give us a thumbs up. We would really appreciate it. And thanks so much for spending a little bit of time with us today. We hope you enjoyed it and we hope to see you again soon. And thanks for watching Wandering Roots.